Hello and welcome to episode 51 of the Youth Squad Legends series with AFC Wimbledon. Where is our boy? It's now given the green light. Edvaldo it is. Off the transfer list. Thank goodness. And straight back in the starting lineup, I think. Marvellous Billy out. Sorry, mate. Edvaldo is here. AFC Wimbledon against Brentford. Oi, oi. Normal service resume, perhaps? I hope so. Callum O'Flannery all over it. And he going himself. He wins the ball back. Oh, mate. So... Just frighteningly quick. Look at Callum O'Flannery. And he's still on his feet. Callum O'Flannery. I've got to go with Callum O'Flannery now, haven't I? Damn. Oh. Oh. What? Schneeg. Yes. Go on, Schneeg. What a man. Schneeg through ball. Absolutely atrocious at passing. You really need to learn. Should have been an interception somewhere, boys. Well done, Adam Nichols. Chip it up. Yep. Yeah. Callum O'Flannery, what is that pass? We just survived it. And now it's running time, baby. Callum O'Flannery, ball in. Not good enough. Oh, Beckich. Oh, is it all Beckich? Is it really all Beckich? That is a massive chance there for Brentford. As like Salt. Just wait for the Obby Jackers run. He's onside because of that wing back ball in tipped away. As like Salt might be better at passing, but he definitely doesn't keep it ticking like Django Swinkles could. Edvaldo and Beckett are on this side. That is where most of the problems come from. Corner kick to Brentford. Here goes Enzo Body. Well done. And Callum O'Flannery is on his way. Run! Callum O'Flannery! Man, he's going to lose all his stamina in the first half, but he has been super effective. Go on. Obi Jackers! It's a banger! By King Obi! And he's hugging marvellous billiard of all people. Sound that, boys. It's a 1-0 lead going into the half-time break. It's Schneeg with the worst first touch in the world. Jacob Vieranan gets him out of trouble. Schneeg slightly fouled the man, but we'll ignore it. Oh, he's toe-poked it. He's onside! Oh, gone, go! Come on then, boys! I don't think he's actually known that he's put the ball in. He might have just tripped over and go, oh, there you go. <laughs> yeah, I meant that. I'll be Jackers. I'm going to try and be cheeky. Oh, oh, it's grazed it. That's a pound. Mmm, Jacob Vieira now just lets that go. Clean sheet bonus. Rides on it. Edvaldo. I was going to say Disco. It's not anymore. That is a great block and it could even become more as Obi Jackers makes it three. Where's Edvaldo? Mate, he's not even running up. He is absolutely cream crackered. <laughs> Which is fair enough, mate. Oh, I'm not even wearing a Wimbledon shirt. How did I not notice that? The game is still on and I am changing shirts. Seems to be full time. I've come back and the game's over. Just loaded up pro clubs for no reason. It's going to be a loan offer. Freedom Payton. I'm accepting it. Transfer offer for Edvaldo. Well, I've just taken him off the transfer list, so you should know better. Carbiar has been sold. Bye. We certainly have enough left wingers to chuck one wanko on the long list this is looking very very possible like we got five hours two deals on the table for to chuck one wanko so to chuck has been loaned out and so has Peyton. i think we've done exactly what we needed to do we're just a little bit short on the left backs but that'll be fine oh good training injury oh good dominic watts is out for seven days no mick stanko cannot be on the bench that's not how football works. Mate, Charlie Adam is still going unbelievable. I'm feeling weirdly confident, and it's strange because Reading don't look weak at all, but there you go, a full rotation apart from Jackers and Bardi. Oh, it seems like Obi Jackers is now the top goal scorer in the league. Great, from now on, I'll be skipping the intros. Thanks, lads. Bright Chato goes wide. Anderson Palulu. Oh, yes, Anderson Palulu. It's another one for him. Oh, as well controlled. He's only like 53 overall. He's looking pretty tasty. Touches of silk. 53 overall. Anderson Palulu. He's onside. Well done, Enzo Body. Very brave to dive to someone's feet. And uh, look, this is just exceptional goalkeeping. And he's putting the other pass into shame. Can someone in this team just pass a ball? Richie Ruffles. I'll have a go at that. Oh, I think Obi Jackers might have the slight bit of luck. Oh, Kamal Timsino, hey! Come on, Kamal Timsino! Rising like a phoenix. 
from the ashes. Almost gone. Transfer listed looked like no hope, but we changed the formation and suddenly there was a spot for him. And he scored two in two. He's safe now. Kamal cena has got a future here. Kamal Timsina. Anderson Palulu is onside. Puts the ball in. Boris drops it down. Oh! I don't know what just happened, but it nearly went in. Oh, MK Dons are getting ripped up against Derby. 4-0 down. You know what's the most amazing thing? Our next fixture. Yeah, MK Dons. This has been a truly exceptional display from the youngsters. But still no clean sheet. Oh, it's Charlie Adam who scored. We've just got to keep it nice and simple for the next 90 seconds. Innocent for far not. We can do a little bit more. Oh, is that going to be costly? No, it isn't because the referee called full time. That's Reading 1, Wimbledon 2. So close to that clean sheet. The kids deserved it. I mean, that scoreline is shocking. MK Dons nil. Derby County 4. Their morale will be crushed. And now we've got them at home. Smash behavior. They've just brought in a really good 79 overall region. Some of the new signings, Vidigal, Asher, Reese King, players that you'll remember, Cosma, Andrada. Hang on, is this a full regen team? Wow, fair play. AFC Wimbledon against MK Dons. First one at Plough Lane. This is going to be spicy. 90 more minutes of limp injury in the mud. Oh, I don't mind if I do. This will be a great showing of the new tactic in action. Can it get more chances against a five-man defense? It's been designed to do so. The players are not familiar with the system. Can't really expect them to be at this moment in time, but I'm still wanting results, even if it's not a win. More shots, please. Okay, well, this is going to have to be a save by Enzo Bardi, and indeed it is. Have they sold Rory Hood? Like my attention was all on the new player that they got, the 79 overall striker. Slightly forgot about Rory Hood, but I really don't think I've seen his name because if I did, surely I would have put him in. Well done, Enzo Bardi. Another one. Oh, my goodness. Deep defending currently by AFC Wimbledon. Ma magic. It's magic by Enzo Bardi. He slides in and just saves the corner kick, gets himself a goal kick. Insane. It's been all MK done so far. But the scoreline remains the same because we have something simply astonishing in our net. Unmarked player in the box, just there. Bekic has done great and blocked by Aslak Salt. Another block by Aslak Salt. We're going to get this out eventually. I've seen enough of the MK Dons now. I know their game. We're taking Aslak Salt off, bringing on Boris Stiapovich. They do not rely on technical ability in defense. It's pace abusers against pace abusers. Fight through the terrible game. And get us a really lovely win. Oh, Enzo Bardi, you are just glorious. It's up to Ruben Cook. And now a Conquo. He's shouting, get up there, OB Jackers, to win the game! Oh, that was good, wasn't it? That has been a very, very satisfying game of football. I pushed through the nonsense. The EA aids are not going to happen for MK Dons. Unless they do happen. Is he offside? Yeah. <laughs> Can we turn it? Oh, is a conk onside? No. No, we've been flagged. Once again, I don't think it gets rid of the ghost of 4-0 past. But it goes some way in repairing it. Two wins against the MK Dons on the bounce. Really close to it, although you can see with the passes out of defence, they are rather disgusting. Edvaldo's had a wonderful game. Like the defence has all of it, and there's a hole there. Now we're gonna completely regret it. Oh, Enzo Bardi with another one. We've played over the two minutes. Just give us the win. Out by Boris Stiapovic. Referee, call it. Thank you. Oh, no, it's not even... Oh, my goodness. It's been four minutes of out of time. Just blow for full time. Blow for full time. Dear me. That took a lot of energy out of me, and quite rightly, they're focusing on Enzo Bardi. What a hero. I think what you meant to say by that is decisive saves. 
against MK Dons. Millwall against AFC Wimbledon. Oh, just because you've got the softly spoken, marvellous Billy out behind you instead of Edvaldo with veins sticking out, screaming in your face, right? Doesn't mean to say that you can slack off, Schneg. I don't want to see it. Let's go. Out. Not with your knee. Edvaldo is on the bench. Do you want Edvaldo? I'll bring him on and I'll give him orders to smack you over the head. To slap you. To slap you, silly, Schneg. Oh, oh mate, Enzo Body. Even Lee Dixon's calling him absolutely amazing now. Nah. Schneg, easy ball. Oh, no, it's right there for you. Callum O'Flannery was right there for you, and I cannot believe that's been said by Enzo Bardi. Let's watch this replay. Mate, what is going on? He's having the episode of his life. Enzo Bardi, this is just stupid. We can't pass. We're failing miserably. Is that a no Oh! Oh my goodness, he's... Not what? What is powering him? I can't close my mouth. My jaw's done. I've lost it. This game really is driving me nutters at the moment. I just cannot wait to get off it today. Schneeg. Uh, well played, Dalibor Bekic. Pull that first off. I think Edvaldo is needed. Here comes the keeper. Enzo Body! What do you mean our next fixture is against the MK Dons? Here comes the corner kick. That's nice! Bekic! Oh, yes! Delabor Bekic! Get in! This has been such a testing day of recording. Edvaldo spun. It's another save by Enzo Body. Any other keeper in the world, and we would have lost to these. We would have lost the MK Dons. I mean, a draw's still not bad. I shouldn't be finishing the episode after taking 10 points out of a possible 12, feeling this drained. Of course we have. Drawn against the MK Dons, round three of the Carabao Cup. One year loan for Dan Cohn, we will accept that. If we hadn't conceded that last minute goal against Millwall, we would have been top. Where are the MK Dons? They've not started off well, 14th place. All right, this has been Cutsy. Thank you for watching this episode of Youth Squad Legends. If you've enjoyed it, then please give the video a like. If you're not subscribed around here yet, then press the red box down below and the bell icon for mobile notifications. It's New Year's Eve as I'm recording this, but I realize that I'm not gonna get it out in time. So um, hope you have a wonderful New Year's and you'll see this video, New Year's Day. All right, see you in a bit.